Google actually just released the Nano Banana Pro version, which is actually very insane and crazier than the first version that was actually released. Now take a look at the images and the visuals that have been generated with these AI. You can see the crazy detailing into the images that has been generated. The details, it pays attention to the details you give to it in generating the images or giving you your visuals. Now look at these, a photorealistic Mortal Kombat character select screen with famous people. Now this entire visual was actually generated with this AI and you can see how amazing it is and you see it pays attention to the detailing of what it is giving to you. So make sure to subscribe to the channel and like this video as we are going to go into the um, detailed version of how we can actually use and how the Nano Banana Pro works with Higgsfield AI. So stay tuned and subscribe to the channel. Now let's dive in. So the first thing we'll need is our prompt. You can ask ChatGPT to write you a prompt and then you can copy your prompt and come to and come to Higgsfield AI. Now when you're under Higgsfield AI, under the image section, you can see down here, you can actually select whichever of the um, model, AI model you want to use to generate. So you're going to select the Nano Banana Pro version. Now you can also change your ratio, your aspect ratio, if you want your image to be in 16 by 9 or by 9 by 16 so whichever one you choose you would actually pick your image ratio now what's that once that's done you're going to select your image quality do you want your image to be generated in 4k in 1k or in 2k so i'm going to generate images in all of the qualities so i'm going to generate in 1k i'm going to generate in 2k and i'm also going to generate in 3k and then i'm going to show you the results of these three Generations. So make sure to stay tuned to the end of the video and subscribe to this channel if you are yet to um, subscribe. So like this video and subscribe and make sure to turn on post notifications to stay updated when we post. So here are the final outputs and generations of our images and our scenes. You can see from my right to the left, the first one is generated in 1K, the second one in 2K and the last one was generated in 4K. So let's have a look at what it is. Let's expand this and have a look at it. You can see this image right here and the detail that was actually given to this. You can see the um, neon effect. You can see the characters written in different languages, um, French, Japanese, um, Chinese, and then you can see the other generations as well. So let's have a look at other generations we would make with these so the process is simple the link to Higgsfield AI will be in the description you just click on it and go over to the image section select your nano banana and then you get your prompts from ChatGPT or if you have your prompts already elsewhere you can copy that paste to the prompt section and then generate it is that simple so this was an image I generated for a, an, a zombie apocalypse scene and then I'm going to actually generate something else this is something else I like about this new feature. You can actually replicate a character that you want. You can actually generate an image of a scene of a character or any character that you wish to. So you can see here in this scene, I have um, Homelander and Cristiano Ronaldo in one scene. And here you can see Cristiano Ronaldo seated in his luxury apartment and um, Homelander busting in through the wall. So this actually took notes to the detailing of the of the scene of the scenario from the wall breaking to homelander floating in and um, cristiano ronaldo still sitting down and not being shocked so this new feature is actually very amazing the upgrade is actually good and you can also animate your image that you generate if you want to turn your image to a video scene you can actually do that you can animate it into a video give it your prompts and it's going to animate it into a video or if you just want the character to talk you can also do that so like I make mention before this is actually very simple and direct to do just log into your Higgs field select the nano banana pro and then you know give it your prompt and there you go so this is simple let's have a look at other um, generations that was actually made using this AI. So make sure to subscribe and like this video if you haven't. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video.